guys welcome back to my channel today is going to be a tutorial kind of it's gonna be me recreating my best friend's makeup look my friend posted this picture on Instagram probably a few months ago after I bought her after I bought her this Urban Decay single shadow in the shade Maui Wowie because she's going to Maui Maui <laughs> Um, and she did this really beautiful makeup look, so I wanted to recreate that on my channel, and she gave me the okay. So, if you want to see how I got this look, then just keep watching. Okay, so I'm going to start with the Ciate London. It's like a mini travel bronzer in the shade Bamboo Bronze, and I'm just going to use this as my transition shade because there isn't one in the palette that I'm using, and I'm just building this up to add some definition to my crease. Then I'm going to go in with the uh, Makeup Revolution Division palette and I'm first going to go into this warm chocolate brown shade and I am going to blend this onto my eye to kind of diffuse it into the crease shade. And I am dipping back into the shade a few times to build it up. I'm doing the same thing on the other eye but I took a bit more product to start with. So in Elise's makeup look, they, it was a bit more warm toned than the brown I had, so I'm going in with this um, orange shade from the palette and just to warm up the eye look, and I'm just going over that original chocolate brown shade with the same brush. And that's the top of the lids. Then I'm going into lower lash line. I'm taking these two, one's like a forest green and one is a, a uh, peach shade, and I'm just putting them onto my lower lash line. I did have to build these up quite a lot to get the pigment I wanted. And then I'm going in with Maui Wowie. I'm sorry, I don't have like footage of the actual thing. I don't know why I didn't take it. But this shade is very light to begin with, so I built it up quite a lot and then I decided I wanted it a little bit more so I took my finger and just packed that on there to get the most amount of pigment it's supposed to be a lighter shadow and that's what Elise did so I wanted to do the same thing as her she looked gorgeous by the way to intensify the green I'm taking this pixie eyeliner in the shade khaki and I'm just putting this onto my waterline just so we get a bigger pop of green And since the palette doesn't have any highlight shade, I'm taking the ColourPop uh, Super Shock Cheek in Lunch Money and I'm just putting this on the inner corners of my eye and also I'm tapping this onto the brow bone. Then I'm going in with my Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. This is in the shade Brown Black. I'm just speeding up here the process of my eyelashes because I don't know, I think it's really cool when I watch people put their mascara on, so I decided to do this. And that's with mascara on. Then I'm going back into the face. I'm taking this Tarte blush in the shade Parte and I'm taking it on a denser blush brush. I tried to do it this time. I just tapped off some excess product to give it a little bit more ba-boom. Then I'm going back in with that ColourPop highlighter in Lunch Money again and I'm tapping this on the high points of my cheeks. And this is so intense and buttery. I think it's even more creamy than Flexitarian, which I didn't think was possible. It just looks incredible. Look at that glow. And I'm doing that on the other side as well. So that is what it looks like with the cheek highlight. It just looks so good. And I'm also putting this onto my Cupid's bow and also my nose. Then I'm going in with this Morphe setting spray. I realize I never film me like setting my face, but I always do. I just actually bought this and I really like it. I've heard so many good things. It's always sold out. So it came to Ulta and it actually smells really good too. So that is my whole face. Now I'm going into lips. I'm taking this LA Girl lip liner in the shade Nude and I'm putting that onto my lips. Then I'm taking the Shayla and ColourPop collab in the shade Quickie and just throwing that onto my lips as well. Elise didn't have any lipstick on so I chose a Nude. Okay guys, that completes this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I feel like I did it justice. I feel like her eyes were maybe a little bit more warm toned than mine ended up being, but I tried to add that um, orangey yellow shade to warm up the brown so I hope I did it I did it justice she looks absolutely beautiful again I'm gonna post a picture of her right here and maybe what's her what's her face 
Do we look close? No, she has more of a... How does she have such good angles? Anyway, her angle is different than mine, so I'm going to pose this way and she'll pose that way. So I hope it turned out pretty similar. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Again, please subscribe if you want to, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.